Gano in the semi-final and an impressive semi-final beating the defending world champion Tiara Brown for the Philippine boxer. Well for Dobrenina, she just joined the Russian squad last year so again two very exciting boxers in this uh, featherweight division but uh, the 22 year old Philippine boxer has been quite outstanding so far in this championship coached by Nolito and Raul Velasco two of the established uh, Olympic coaches for the Philippines Take a look at uh, Neste here. Fifth in the Asian Games for 2014. This is her second world championships in her career, but uh, knocked out the prelims of the 2012 championships in China. But again, has been the giant killer of the featherweight division. Goes up against uh, Zinaida Dobrinina, European champion. For 2014, three times Russian national champion, but only joining the uh, Russian national squad last year. You can see it ranked 13 at 60 kilos, and uh, she's come down to 57 kilos, the Philippine boxer for this world championships. World ranked five at the Russian. And there. Uh, the uh, confirmation of the European Championship gold that she won in uh, Bucharest, Romania. Uh, David Williams of uh, Wales is the referee for this uh, featherweight final. Chinese Taipei, Denmark, Algeria, the USA and Poland are the nationalities of the five judges in bout 264. The 57 kilogram featherweight final. This is the first of a potential four gold medal haul for the Russian team here. All of ten of their squad members made the quarterfinals, five in the semis and four through to the ten weight divisions in the final of these uh, world championships here today. Strong boxer, southpaw stance of course, lead hand with the left and it's uh, with the right I should say with the southpaw boxer and it's a very strong right hook that she delivers. Gotta keep moving the Russian, force the uh, Southport and lead. Circle away from that stronger hand. That's the left. Of course. But as we said earlier, very strong puncher with both the lead left and the right, the boxer in red for the Philippines.
Drops the head very low, doesn't she? Neste, the Philippine boxer in red. Just frustrating uh, Dobrenina just a little. First round. Well, the opening exchanges for me went uh, the way of the Philippine boxer Neste here. Dobrenina didn't start well in her semi final. Getting through with the left hand there and the uh, right hook. Good uppercut as well. She's good when she's in close, uh, Neste. But two of the judges uh, give uh, Dobrenina the advantage. And uh, one of the judges giving the 10-9 must point score to the Philippine boxer. Very close in the first round. Nesti, of course, the only... ...boxer for the Philippines here in these finals. Good right hook again. That's the shot that brought uh, Neste Pedico so much success in her semi final. That's the move left outside the line of attack, uh, Dobrinina. Straight right, the head and body. That's the shot she's looking for. Passed halfway in the second round. Good combinations from both boxers. Good work downstairs as well from the Philippine in red. Just misses with that right hook. Good fast punches though from uh, Petisio. That's a good straight one-two punch combination. Great work from uh, Dobrenina. Good tactics from the Russian. Ten seconds left on the clock in this second round. To say the south ball from the Philippines, boxing the taller Russian. Very oh, and what a great closing combination from the Philippine boxer, right on the bell of the second round. That could clearly swing that second round to her advantage. Take a look at some of the replays here. It doesn't really show us a lot, but um, all three of uh, the judges with uh, Dobrenina giving the uh, Russian a good advantage. European champion at the halfway point with the advantage here and uh, the lead so far. Now, does that give Neste of the Philippines a little extra zest? Looks to pick it up a little bit or does she stick to the same tactical plan? Uh, Dobrenina so far getting the better of the exchanges from the southpaw. So often has been awkward for the orthodox boxer to take on the south ball, but Dobrenina has prepared well for this final bat. Good straight punches to the body, followed by a, the right to the head. Excellent work from uh, Dobrenina. 
Staying calm. Technically sound, skilled boxing. Just as I say that. Big left hook from the Philippine. Better body shots from Neste there as well. And again, that straight punch and three punch combination on target every time for Dobranina. And that's what's putting the points on the board and impressing the judges for the Russian out of the blue corner. tries to put the big left hand across, leaves herself open, and the footwork of the Russian allows her to put that right hand through on multiple occasions in this third round. Covers up well to uh, Dobrenina. Ten seconds to go in the third round. The Russian looking to maintain her advantage. That's a better combination from uh, Pesicio. And again, uh, Dobrenina. Serving up the same in the third as she did in the second. Let's take a look at the replays. Good body shot with the left there. There again, Dobrinina. Not only putting in a good three punch combination there. This time Dobrinina puts a good strong right hand to the body. Followed by two punches in close quarter. Dobrenina given that round by two of the judges. But all three scores have the Russian ahead going into the fourth and final round. 30-27 by one of the judges is three, obviously clear. And uh, Dobrenina just has this bout and this uh, final. Certainly the gold medal is within her sights. Just needs to maintain form and tempo as you'd expect Neste Peticchio of uh, the Philippines starts to risk a little more and there is a lovely four punch combination well, clearly the instruction from the round for the Philippine is to uh, Take a few more risks in search of more points. She needs a huge round here. Peticchio to um, stop Dobrenina. Minute left, halfway point, fourth round. Good right hand from the Russian. Again, a nice uh, double sh straight shot from the right hand. Thirty seconds. Potentially Russia's first goal of four here. With a good strong right hand that stops Neste. Stops the Philippine. Stops her rhythm. Stops the cadence of punches that was looking good at the start. Dobrina, Dobrinina of Russia looking the stronger towards the end. Good shot to the right. And an uppercut to the chin. Good strong back from both boxes, but for me the Russian has just taken that gold. European champion from Russia looking to add the world championship gold. Some great shots from Neste here though. By far the best round of the four for the Philippine. The right hand. Double shots. The winner.
Two to zero, Dobrenina for Russia takes the gold. Good tactical boxing from the 24-year-old Russian. <laughs> 